Hi, my name's Jess Bard. I'm here in southern Peru in the Amazon jungle and I'm here to talk to you about the thousands of types of insects that inhabit the jungle here and how to keep you safe. Now, the first thing I need to mention, it is inevitable. You are going to get bitten in the jungle, but there are some things we can do to minimise this. So the first thing that we do in the morning is spray DEET onto our body. This just helps repel the insects. The second thing we can do is use mosquito nets. They just go straight over the top of the head and it helps avoid skin contact. This is also the same for wearing long sleeves and long trousers. Now, there are some insects you definitely need to look out for. Some bites are definitely nastier than others. So the first is the bite of a mosquito. The bite of a mosquito can cause a thing called malaria. This will come up on the skin as a very high fever. The next thing we need to look out for is a sandfly bite. A sandfly bite can cause a thing called lesomoniasis. Now this comes up on the skin as giant ulcers. The last that we need to definitely look out for is the bite from a bullet ant. A bullet ant is called a bullet ant due to the pain being related to that of a bullet wound. Now, a bullet ant is actually a much, much bigger version of these little leaf cutter ants down here about this big. But don't worry, there are several ways we can treat them. So the first is by taking antihistamine. You can take this orally and it works from the inside out. It'll get rid of itchiness and inflammation. We can also use a cream that does the same thing. So using the cream, put it straight onto the bite and it helps straight away. Now, the last one is a shock system. The shock system is just here and it works by putting it over the top of the bite, taking a click and it's said to distract you away from the itchiness. It's really great, I use it myself. Uh, that is my Jungle Minute. I'm Jess Ballard, thank you very much.